I rise today with an infinite appreciation for the institution of the United States Senate, as well as a profound sense of gratitude as I prepare to conclude my 18 years in the Senate and my nearly 40 years in elective office on behalf of the people of Maine. Ms. Madam President, it's been difficult to envision this day when I would be saying farewell to the Senate. Just as it was impossible to imagine, I would one day become a United States Senator as I was growing up in Maine. But such is the miracle of America that a young girl of a Greek immigrant and first generation American who was orphaned at the age of nine could in time be elected to serve in the greatest deliberative body the world has ever known and become the third longest serving woman in the history of the United States Congress. Throughout my tenure, I've borne witness to government's incredible potential as an instrument for that common good. I've also experienced its capacity for serial dysfunction. Indeed, as I stated in announcing I would not seek a fourth term in the United States Senate, it is regrettable that excessive political polarization in Washington today is preventing us from tackling our problems in this period of monumental consequences for our nation.